Today we're going to unbox and install the new Helix retransfer printer from Magicard. First of all let's look at the accessories. So you have a USB cable, global power supplies, a 200 card output hopper, your 200 card input hopper, a quick start guide that will take you step by step through the installation process, and some cleaning cards to get you started. In addition to this you'll also need retransfer film, colour dye film, and some blank cards. Don't forget to register your printer at the Magicard support portal as this will also give you access to upgrades for your Helix printer. Okay now onto the printer. First remove any packing tape from the front of the printer then also from where the cleaning roller is located remove the cover from the pre-installed cleaning roller. Next locate the 200 card input hopper then to locate the output hopper lift the machine Locate the hopper under the machine and then click it firmly into place. Now you can connect the appropriate power supply for your region. And your USB or Ethernet connection. Next, insert your blank cards into the input hopper by lifting the latch and carefully locating the cards. Now power up your helix and load die film by releasing the catch on the front door and sliding out the easy load die film cassette. This has been designed specifically to prevent your die film coming into contact with the desktop um, and contaminating the film. So locate the blue spool on the retransfer film against the blue arrow and the corresponding spool in the appropriate slot and then next your colour dye film the white spool against the white arrow and the corresponding spool in the appropriate slot then close up the easy load cassette slide it back into your printer close your front door you can also access instructions on how to replace dye film from the touchscreen with animated help videos on replacing dye film, replacing filters and on replacing the tacky roller. From this menu you can also view the available holocoats on your device whether these are the pre-installed holocoats or your own custom security designs. Now we can see by clicking on the temperature gauge the Helix is up to temperature and ready to print. Next, install the printer driver. We recommend that you navigate to the Magicard support portal, find the latest driver there to ensure you have the most up-to-date version for your printer. If you wish to perform an offline uh, installation, we do include a CD-ROM in your accessories pack. Once the driver is installed, Select your connection type, whether it be USB or Ethernet, and then when prompted, connect the appropriate cable to your PC. The printer status monitor will inform you the printer's ready, and now you can open up the driver properties, make your settings for your print. You can choose the secure holocoat watermark that you wish to put on the surface of your card. You can also add encoding settings, change image qualities, and increase density with printhead power. Once you're happy with your settings, And send your printed image to the printer. Your image will be previewed on the Helix touchscreen. You'll also be able to see progress of your image and less than 30 seconds later your card will be printed. For more information on Helix visit magicard.com.